Welcome back everybody to the next episode of Breath of Fire 4. Happy Friday. You've all made it. You deserve... Hopefully this is something you enjoy. I mean, if you're watching, I would assume you do. We're like 40 some odd in. Uh, but yeah, you, you deserve a nice weekend, so get ready for that. And let's go to what I believe to be Faolu's Tome. Um, now, I will say I learned something on accident. And that is something... Can I go up here? No? Okay. And that is about a certain enemy. When I was looking up recipes for, um, um, for Urshan's armor, I learned that there is an enemy, it said, in Faolu's Tome. I was like, oh, I wonder when I'll get there. Apparently it's now. Uh, two episodes after looking it up. And there's an enemy that drops what is apparently Urshan's best armor. Ooh, good crit. Now I... I do believe it is um, pretty tough, and there's a special way to fight it, and I don't know how rare it is, so like, will we even encounter it? I hope so, but I can't guarantee it. Um, hmm. Maybe I do have to go up that way? Dun, dun, dun. Hmm. Oh, gold! Um, uh, just attack, and you can do that, and that's probably enough, right? I mean, Shining Blade is so strong. Don't. Good. I was like, don't stop him from doing Shining Blade. Oh, they have a lot of defense. Oh, Matron, 12 thousands any I should have used charm I love I just absolutely adore that attack sequence you know, you know, slash it's just, they're such a fun enemy I want to I want to like run a D&D &D campaign in this setting someday not necessarily this game but like the the world of breath of fire the universe of it okay so I can't get up there cool uh this way um. Okay. I just I'd say anything like you know, or just honestly, bring in monsters from any game into a normal D and D campaign. I think that'd be a lot of fun. Um, be like here's a slime, here's a golem from you know, Dragon Quest. Here's a um Hell House from Final Fantasy VII. Most memorable monster from that game for me. More memorable than Chef Severo. Now, let's see how low it is. And do I risk using Ursula instead? Yes, I do. So we'll do that. Followed by that. Followed by that. Morph. Yes! Strategies, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, you didn't die. Interesting. Kind of thought you would. Uh, sir, that's rude. I'm just, you know, you're going to get shot in the face, sir. How's, how's this shot going to feel? And it was like, don't feel too good, sir. Thanks. Ding, ding. Burnt plug. Mm, sounds sexy. Uh, to the right, to the right. Nothing to the right. Okay. Okay. Oh, look at this. Um, anything up there? Looks like a no. And I did loot this place, right? This was before I knew to not loot, I believe. Oh god, do I have to fight this guy? That's his his protector, right? Oh, hey. Uh, how you doing? Shining Blade. Um. Okay, good. That's going off. Come on. Because I think they'll run away. I knew they run away. They, yes. They would run away in Breath of Fire 3, so I'm just not sure. Um. Uh.
Yeah, do I have to fight this guy? Or is he gonna recognize me as like being, I don't know, one part of Falu and be like, oh, you can enter. I doubt that is the case. Oh, by the way, check this out. Boy, let's see what this does. Return user to normal, but at a price, actually. Let's give that a go. I just want to see it. Magic ball. I need to use that. Let's see how it does. So it's what? Physical damage as magic, I think? Something like that? Or maybe it goes against the defense? I can't remember. Um, but. Hatch. You know how much I've learned about Hatchimals, by the way, guys? It's crazy. Oh! <gasps> We attacked with a chicken. That's kind of my favorite thing. That was worth seeing. Oh, um. Who's your master? Oh, is he with Nomo? I think he's with the fairy. Why? Why did I make that weird choice? Um. Well, okay. If this thing is the protector of Falu, probably the same element as Falu. So let's put on. Do I have an ice ward? Water ward? Or do I have the one that like? Ring of? I don't think I do. So can I double up though, huh? Let's do that. Um, do you want that? Yeah, you total crap. Um, no. Yes, yeah, I'm just gonna assume. You know, we'll we'll change in battle if need be. Um, I'm gonna assume he's gonna have water spells. And he's blue. Yeah, he's blue. He's gonna definitely use like Blizzard or something. Who goes there? What, what was that voice? Who dares enter the sacred resting place of my master? Um, your master's other half? Wow, you're getting taller. Wait, thou also are one of the Edenists. Yep. No matter. No one. Nay, e'en though they be brother to my master, may be allowed entrance. Okay, good boy. Um, one of the magical creatures that surf out loose. So let's do the thing first. Um, and if this doesn't work we've at least got um charm on him which is good for the end of battle though he probably has like guaranteed drops as a boss um but maybe he has a rare drop as well moon tears i don't know what that does but we got it cool so bosses have a very easy steal rate worth burning Stone pillar. Okay, not what I expect. Oh no, Nina's weak. Okay, that's fine. It's a one hit. I was like, don't hit Nina. She's weak to that. Even though she could fly off that thing. Just saying. So let's. Um. Yeah, let's go fire. And. What is it? Fire into wind, so... If anything else... Inf oh, you have Inferno! Sure! And then... Giga Flare! Now, can I... Scaffold Dragon Magic off of that? Let's try that. Let's make a Giga Flare. And then use our strongest dragon magic. I swore I'd seen something in a guide somewhere that they're like, yeah, there are special combos with dragon magic. 
Also, have we seen Inferno yet? Oh, 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 that looks nice. That's a lot of damage coming from Ursula. That is good. That might be more than Giga Flare. Probably not. Nina is stronger. It was. Wow. It was better. <gasps> Frost Breath. I fucking called it, guys. I called it. Do I need to put on... Ooh. Okay, so let's try it out. So we're going to do that again. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And we have what? Hewish. Hewish. Inferno! Come on, give me a cool combo. I want to see it with my face. As I stay hydrated, ladies and gentlemen. Mm. That means drink your water right now, folks. I'm gonna keep you healthy. Oh! <gasps> it's comboing! Or, it's not comboing, but it's... I mean, it's comboing, but it's not making a thing. Oh! Oh! That was good damage. That was really good damage. Okay, good. No one fell asleep. I was like, that could really hurt. Mm. Hate to break it to you folks, but we're going to do the same damn thing. Instant kill results are just now... Oh, wait. I accidentally clicked on it. What does Inspire do? Yes. Raise his wisdom stat. Probably should have just attacked this round. Oh well. I mean, 2,300 is more than she would have done with her gun, so... Oh, is it still going to combo? Interesting. So is it going to hit twice, then? It did. Very cool. Very cool. Cheesecake! Um... Why isn't this working? Can you unplug my controller? Um... Um, let me, hold on. Guys, I don't know what's happening. Oh, good. I thought the game had frozen. I was going to be like, oh. right, Urshan, you're up. Um, Typhoon and a Hawish. A little sad that it looks just like Inferno. And we learned that, like, right away. Because I was like, oh, first time seeing Inferno. First time seeing Hawish. And I was like, ow. Oh. Quite a bit weaker than Ursula by like 400. That's okay. That's okay. But with the wisdom up, will Ryu be noticeably stronger? And this is a great combo. For only a couple of hits? Look at that. 7.8k? Ooh. I think I should heal with Nina. Oh, that did nothing. Does she have the thing on? Whatever, I should probably heal anyway, so let's just do this. Vital. Uh, yeah, everybody, good, good. And, um. Damage changes with remaining HP. Um. We haven't seen this. Gravity attack? Let's check that out. I was going to be mad if that killed it, actually. <laughs> oh! I can use that to get combos. Interesting. Oh my god, that's the dragon. Oh! Oh! You are like a squid. That is what I expected from the water. We haven't seen the water dragon yet, by the way, either. 
Oh, I love me some gravity magic. Give me some Diablos in Final Fantasy VIII. Or Atomos and nine. Oh, not very strong though. Great. No, it was. Oh, I said it was going to use Blizzard, didn't I, folks? Though I still claim this is diamond dust. Also, is there anything that can hit the back row? Because I hope the answer is no. Let's do the thing again. And... I, I mean, we're not going to stun a boss, so... Uh, huage, huage, huage. I don't know, guys. I don't know. Juan, Hua, Quay, Ku. How do you say that? Juan, Q, Ku, Quay, Qua, Qua. I don't know. I don't know. I am not familiar with um, Japanese or Chinese naming systems. Something's happening with those in the background. I don't know what got. <gasps> we gosh done dark did it! Yams! Woo! <laughs> oh, 30,000. Holy crap. I mean, it's a boss, but it's still 60 HP. Who are you with Momo? Nice, nice. 11 AP, 11 wisdom. Cupid's Leer. Will that heal you when you move? Oh, that's it? No, like, dead dialogue or something? Um, let's check out the Cupid's Leer. Also, let's... Uh, what, asbestos armor? Or amber plate? Give the amber plate, yeah. Give that back to Ryu. Do... Actually, let's give him the Titan boots. Ten HP, ten per step, fifty per turn in comp. Oh, oh, that's pretty good. Um, no, I, I should have healed, but whatever. Um, case okay, so we're inside. God, I want this to be its own episode. I really do. We've only got like 18 minutes. I can't just be like, nope. I mean, I can. But that would be rude. I just feel like this place is going to be long. Ah, we'll find out. If I have to split it, I will. Dun, dun, dun. Guardian. One, two, three. Uh, sure. Ever. Whatever, sir. Um, and yeah, if you guys hear Oats whooping in the back, she's playing WoW, so she gets happy sometimes. Did you get some, Did you get the helmet? What? Get the helmet? Okay, so something good didn't happen, but she said whoop anyways. Iron scrap. Oh, you have defense, I see. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Thinking magic. Try this. Let's try. This. Try. But not why you. No, go away. And try, um... Ah, let's do Blizzard. I don't think I used anything in the, in the order. I mean, look at that guy. He, oh, God, yeah. He's not gonna take physical damage. But he will take magic damage. <laughs> yes, he will. Yes, he will. Ding -ding -ding -ding. Um, okay, what? What? I'm sorry, y'all just saw that chest just in, like, the darkness, didn't you? Okay.
Oh, okay. Um, some more gets revealed as we go. What's this gonna say? Nothing. It doesn't say a thing. Okay. Somebody's cool. <sighs> Two of them. Um. So. No, no. Let's do. What is it? Wind into water. But what's water into earth do? What does water into earth do? I don't know. I don't know. Is it lightning? No, lightning is wind into water. So what is this? Disaster. Oh, oh my. That was a lot of stuff. Oh, but it was physical. But their gar armor's been weakened. Okay. Okay. But this will probably kill him anyways. Nope, I guess not. I was, I was about to say, I was kind of hoping, like, their armor would open up, and it does, but I was meaning, like, because their armor is weakened, I was hoping it would open up. But, so let's see how much damage we do now. I mean, you got a hit. Oh, that's just your standard attack? Okay. That's fine. Why am I using my slowest person to start the combat? That is a, uh, an interesting thing that I chose. Nice. Nice. Urshan level 13. Oh, she's starting to get some good stat ups. Ow. Is this that floating chest? Yes, it is. One vitamin. Okay. One vitamin. That's, um... Thing. Oh, hi. Protobots, we've already fought you. I powered up bot with a limited power supply. Um kinda just wanna run. What am I what am I Whatever. Just attack. It's fine. Just what am I doing? Just attack. Right? Are these what I grinded on? I don't think so. Can you one shot it, Cray? Yes! God, he's so powerful. Imagine Cray having a multi-hit weapon. Imagine. Be crazy, dogs. Crazy. Waiting for um, Nina to cheer at us again and be like, yeah, he's a little bit of health. And I'll be like, I'll take a little bit of health. All right, Sai should level up in like two, three battles, maybe. Do you want to go down? No, I want to go up. Up, no smoke. Down with dope. Let me guess, puzzles? It's gonna be puzzles, isn't it? I mean, it's a, a emperor, it's an emperor god's tome. What the hell? Why did those retract? Okay, we've seen a ladder. That's it? Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I don't want to do that right now. Um... I guess I'm doing that right now. Yeah. And honestly, for that room, I do want the holy mantle. I don't want to be doing a puzzle and they be like, nah, dog. Nah. Where is it? There you are. Lower chance of encountering wandering monsters. I bet you again, like two steps. Close enough before we left the room. But you know, we'd also been charging up that meter. What are you? 
Berserker. An out of control machine with an unstable power core. Well, I'm gonna focus target you, sir, cause uh, you might wreck my shop. Um. Okay, well, I mean, don't have anything to fear, I suppose. I want to run into that thing. I'll recognize the name when I see it. I just don't remember what it is right now. Like, I think it has man in it. Like, I haven't seen what the creature looks like. I just... Oh, gosh, nice crit. I just saw the name when looking at uh, Urshan's stuff. Bent screw. And I swear to God, Theron, if you gave me spoilers for it in the last episode comments, I'm going to kill your Pathfinder character. Stand in front of the switch causes the floor to light up. You can push a cube forward by pressing the O button and push it back by pressing the X button. Line three blocks of the same color up to create a path. Oh, the switch over there. So... Nothing to do with those, I guess. Where's the switch? Oh. Oh, crap. But I can't do that one. Oh, other side, herp, derp, and clerp, and sturbin, right? Wait, what did it say? Line three blocks of the same color up to create a path. Oh gosh. I mean, I, I did, technically. So, I'm um, dumb. <sighs> okay, so... Yep, I get it. I get it. Let's reset it. So, I've got to do it from the side, because that supports three. Let's bring you back. Let's also get rid of you. Perfect. Um, is this the one you're with? No, you're on the other side. So I do like that there are no random counters here. Though. This is really nice. Okay. Uh-huh. And I've got to do the same, but with those over there. So, assuming... Um... Oops. <laughs> no, 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 no. I've got to not use the run function apparently, because it's activating it just because I'm running past them whilst holding that button. 
Oh, okay, that's that's not bad at all. I mean, assuming I've got it right here, which I really think I do. Yeah. Um. Okay. I'm, I'm not going to dare run, though. I don't know if it'll still activate them. But, hey. You've got a bead. Oh, you do one and you get that, but an electrifier. What is that? What is an electrifier? Is it a weapon? <gasps> oh my cheesecake, is it? Okay, well, we don't have access to our friends in this room for some reason. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I'm pretty chuffed that I figured that out without looking in the book at all because <laughs> I'm bad at puzzles. Low pow- What do you mean, low power? It's a 110. It's more than double the power of everything else I have. What are you talking about? That is very powerful. So because we did the puzzles, that make the... Because we have the bead. The bead crumbles apart without a sound. Interesting. So the bead is mandatory, the electrifier is not, but why would you do just one is my question. So what I want to do is try this out. Is it just a one shot or something? Um, and then let's just Typhoon, I guess. Okay, so it's only a single shot, which is new for her. We've either had double shots or scatters, but that is a strong single shot. It's like working on trying to be like Cray a little bit. Um. It's just. Let's just take him out. Yeah, for fun. Let's use our very first spell. <laughs> let's use Sever. Oh god, that still did a lot. That was good. That's decent. For our very first spell, that is decent AF. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, well. Didn't mean to use again. Ryu falls asleep. Good job. Good job, Ryu. Good freaking job. But we win. Yay! And a bench screw. Size almost leveled. But ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be the end of the episode. We are already at 33, almost 34 minutes. So I think that's pretty good for an episode. Um, we will finish this place. Um later but i might hunt for that thing whose name i know that will be for um urshan so probably start the next episode with that if i find it but thank you all so much for watching i hope you're enjoying it this is really neat to be where we first found Lu, but on the inside to actually see what's inside wow is it already intricate um, why there's a gun down there, I don't know, but whatever. But thank you so much for watching. Do take care, but until next time, bye-bye for now.